Yeah. Well, we have, obviously we need a new camera, right? We need two new cameras here and, and you and I would like to get paid. Of course. Basically. To do this show. I have a it, bit of a solution. Bear in mind, we have done 10 minutes of ads. Okay, right. well, okay. let's just do a, a really quick, <laughs> just a quick 20 minutes knock it out. of ads. So <laughs> what I was thinking is, is obviously you want the show to be better. You want the show to improve. Absolutely. You're spending shit loads of our money on unnecessary stuff that makes me angry. No. Right? Actually not that expensive at all. Well, okay, whatever, okay? I plus, now I get to, <laughs> plus, now I get to wear this every day forever. <laughs> well, so no, it's fine. No, you don't. Well, when you least expect it, you're going you're gonna to go... Get choked. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to rip it off you. I'm going to pull a 50 cent and snatch your chain. Okay. Uh, we, bri- we talked about this last episode about, you know, whether or not we should get uh, Fleshlight as a sponsor for the show. Um. And I think we both... <laughs> I we really both, thought we were joking. I think, well, no, I think uh, my recollection of it, correct me if I'm wrong, was that we both, all of us agreed that it would be a great idea. Is that correct? Uh, just going to correct you if you're wrong. Yeah. yeah I, I don't think you're right. So you don't think having Fleshlight as a sponsor of the show would be good? I think it'd be funny as a one-off. Oh, funny as a one-off? I don't know if we want to be like known as the Fleshlight guys. Yeah. Well... Uh, like the guys that come in rubber tubes and then tell people other people to do it? Yeah, they would be quite hard yeah. to clean, I yeah. think is what we really thought about. But I was just thinking, you know... It's not a dishwasher, apparently. It's not, <laughs> it's not locked in, but, you know, if I'm just floating the idea. Yeah. If our show was sponsored by Fleshlight, this is what it would be like. This episode of the Luke and Lewis podcast is brought to you by Fleshlight. The world's best tube you can have sex with (laughs) the fleshlight is cool stylish and easy to use is it easy to clean depends do you have a dishwasher i don't want to use a dishwasher well then it's very difficult to clean (laughs) the price starts lower than your dignity if you're buying this because it's 119 dollars the fleshlight will light up your world until you have to clean it But don't believe me, listen to one of our satisfied customers. Hi, I'm Ruben Solo, and I love coming in a silicon pocket. I use this all the time. (laughs) Do you clean it? No. (laughs) Thanks, Ruben Solo. This podcast is sponsored by Fleshlight. Come on, dude, come in a tube. The slogan's good. Yeah, the slogan is good. The slogan's good, and and that guy at the end who gave the that was gross, but I'm yeah. I'm glad he likes it. Yeah, it is. He's yeah, what was his name? Ruben, Ruben Solo. Solo. Yeah, he's yeah. yeah. Free, free great user. Of oh yeah, Instagram guy. He's on TikTok. Yeah, yeah, yeah that yeah. guy. Yeah, it looks a bit like Lord Farquhar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lots of fridge comedy. My dad's missing. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, did you see he did another another one about having no dad? Yeah, on um, uh, it's it's really it was really funny, but yeah. it's I love that his his niche is really haha. You don't have parents. It's yeah, really great. Every and and he, he does a, have parents. Yeah, <laughs> that's why it's so funny. Every time he makes a new version of the haha, you've got no dad. I'm impressed. I'm like, man, that's still funny. Yeah. That's great. Um, so thoughts? Do you reckon we could? I mean, uh, the ad was great. One hundred nineteen dollars. Is that really how much they cost? Yeah, yeah. we googled it. Yeah, right. pay, also, I didn't realize um, I was under the impression that Fleshlight mm. wasn't a company or a brand. I thought it was like Vibrator and there was different brands of Fleshlight. Oh, so originally the, the brand started was because it, you could disguise it as a flashlight in your room. Hey. So it's discreet. And then you would you would spin off the top and of, it's, of it's like the pussy. cover and it's a pussy. Okay. The Fleshlight. Pocket pussy. Right. Is what That's why I thought it was just a, a thing. I didn't think it was a brand, but it's a no, brand. it's an actual See, brand. this is what people don't realize. Another one is Esky mm. is a brand. Yep. Cooler is the product. Mm-hmm. Esky is just the most popular band of Cooler, but now it's got to the point where people like go, oh, we'll get an Esky, and it doesn't really matter Good who brand. makes it. Another one, Glad Wrap. It's a brand. It's actually called Cling Wrap. Yes. Windex. Americans call it Cling Wrap, don't they? Because yes, they don't have they Glad do. Wrap. Uh, Americans also call tissues Kleenex. Because it's Kleenex a brand. Kleenex is a brand of tissues. Yeah. Yeah, that's weird. So thoughts on... Getting sponsored by Fleshlight. Luke? I just think is we have a, a yes lot of a no? cock-related sponsors already. Maybe yeah. we need to hit the VPN market or something like that. Yeah, you know? true. If yeah. I told you I've hit them up and asked for a 
few weeks sponsorship, how would you feel? <laughs> um, I would believe you and... Uh, I didn't tell him to do I'd that. I'd be pretty amused, didn't you? <laughs> no, I didn't tell him to do that. Um, yeah, we'll do it. <laughs> I don't really want to... What wanna... did you say? Uh, I Here's did... the thing is I don't... We, all, <laughs> we have a rule in our show where we... And, it's, and if we break the rule, then it's like... Well, then we then oh, yeah, can the we rule. trust these guys? The rules is like we have to really like the product and <laughs> and and genuinely use it. Yeah, which means one of us has to come in a well, tube and well, then practice washing well, it. This brings us to what I was going to talk about next. We just get that guy Ruben Solo. Mm-mm. He loved it. There may be someone on the team that already owns a flashlight. <laughs> Owned is a possessive, possessive word. <laughs> You notice we all looked at you like, <laughs> uh, not one time. You didn't see me go, Devlin. <laughs> I, everyone went straight to killing. Is this why you knew so much about it last episode? It might be. I'm not yeah. saying anything, but that is a possessive word. And so I'm not. I'm I, not admitting to anything. I found. I may have found out yeah, something dude. yesterday when me and Keelan were working together. But Keelan <laughs> said we're not. We're only allowed to talk about this on Patreon because his mum listens to this. <laughs> Was his words. He goes, oh, yeah. Oh, mum listens to it. Patreon. Uh, Well, you know what is funny? Mum, my room flooded back a couple years ago Mm. and she had to clean out. Because you didn't clean it. (laughs) The laundry flooded, made my room flood. Mm. She had to clean out my room and found a few. Let's save this for Patreon. (laughs) And, you know, let's record the Patreon episode right after because I want to get to the bottom of this. Okay, great. Um, So what what, what are we finishing up But also, I'll... (laughs) Long distance relationships must be rough. Well, let's <laughs> let's not get too graphic because okay. this is you know yeah, and and it's a it's not a family podcast, but <laughs> maybe one it will never be actually that. Mm, yeah. I can be the official ambassador for. Okay, well, all right. Well, you know what's going to happen right now? We're going to do the Patreon episode, and we're going to talk about this flashlight business yep. and get real in depth and Great. figure out once and for all whether or not Keelan owned one, was it used. One, two, three. <laughs> we'll find out the quantity and all the details. All right. I'm actually stoked. Let's I, get into it. It'll be on Patreon right now. I'm concerned. But yeah, thanks for listening. There.